Adrian and I'm your friend Chris and and I'm your friend Andy Whoa! <laughs> yes that's right rat tail family you are seeing a third person mm. on your screen we have a very special special guest, special guest. extra special guest um, for a very very special episode oh we've been waiting for this episode and a lot of you have been bugging us about this episode and so it's probably pretty important that we have a, a special guest here. Andy, we're so happy to have you. And I'd love for you to tell us a little bit about how do we know you, Andy? How do blockheads know you, my dear? Um, easiest way to put it, I work for Danny Woods. So I actually do all of his PR, his social media, all that fun stuff. I, I work full time for Danny. So here we are. <laughs> yeah, we snagged Andy for you. Um, we're really excited to have you on. Yeah. So Andy's here with us because we are finally getting to the step by step album top three. Okay. Yeah. Do you want to tell them yeah. how this episode works? So a little bit of how this works is we're going to listen to a sample of each song probably talk a little bit about about each of them and then at the end we're going to give you our top three and honorable mention yes um and i'm excited andy because you said you like this album right i do yeah this is this is the first album that i remember because i was four so it was like i was able to comprehend what was happening so <laughs> this is this is a favorite this is definitely my top three favorite new kids albums oh that's awesome and so um one thing we've got to remind our rat tail crew to do yes. make sure to smash that subscribe button to join the rat tail family mm -hmm. um we're going to show you a quick piece of eye candy so that's for our subscribers um Thank you so much for subscribing. It really means a lot to have new friends with us mm -hmm. in the Rat Tail family. In the description, you will find all of the links to our socials. Well, let's get this started. Okay, Andy, are you ready for the first song? I think so. I'm excited. Yay! Yay! Okay, we're going to play. We're forgetting something. Oh, I always fucking forget you this. You always fucking Jesus forget Christ. this. Jesus Christ. We okay. are going to take our shoddy shots. Every time. Or hydrate. Look at Andy hydrating. Here we there go. There we go. Let's cheers. Cheers. Andy, thanks for being with us. All right, here we go. One, two, three. Thanks for having me. Anytime. Oh, Jesus Christ. Uh, <sighs> okay. That burns. Now let's get this shit started. Now we're ready. All now right, here we go. Oh. Step by step. Uh. Ooh, baby. Gonna get, get to you, girl. Step by step. step. Everyone, get on the fucking stairs. I mean, let's let him sing a little bit. Step by step. Ooh, baby. Okay, we came out of the gate with this song. So, <laughs> I guess I'll just start us off. I'll just kick <clears throat> us off. Okay. We've already done the step-by-step -step video react. And I think it's hard for me to separate the video from the song because the video is literally five gods. <laughs> they are the most gorgeous they've ever been in their careers in this video. They are like carved out of butter. They are gorgeous. Clay, Clay thank you, not mm -hmm. butter. I, I just, each and every one of them. And the song is a bop. Yeah. It's, it's a bop before a bop was thing. So step by step, Chris, what do you think about Step I by love Step by Step. It's again, I said this in other episodes, my favorite song of all of their songs. So, and I love the video too. 
Wait, of all time? You put it up there? (laughs) I love step by step so much. You're a step by step a file. That sounds bad, though. (laughs) Yeah, but I guess so. (laughs) Andy, what do you think of step by step? It's, you know, it's hard because I've gone to so many shows that, like, the, the top, like, 10 songs you would think of for new kids it's like I hear them and it's like oh but I saw this like 33 times live and it just kind of repeats in your head but when you look at them in that video I mean they're just so young and gorgeous and like Jordan in those overhauls like first of all (laughs) yes damn it it's just everything that like when you when you say new kids on the block this is one of those videos that just it's the staircase it's the overalls Mm -hmm. it's the just the general look like the dance moves like everything's there so if you if you are a new kids fan and you genuinely say you hate the song that's not right like that's i mean we can we can have arguments about other songs on this album which i'm sure we're gonna have that conversation but this one i mean it's iconic it's the song, yes. like, even if yeah. you're not a new kids fan, you're like, I know that song. It's it's great. And, okay, I just, you sparked something to me, Andy. I want to share my top three looks from this video. Okay. First is the hardware hat on Danny. That's the first. <laughs> the second is Danny's cheetah coat. And third is the overalls. That's my top three. I don't know if anyone has to look at that. <laughs> I um, love it. That coat. That coat is one of those like it, it, like ask him about the coat or the hat and those are like an entirely different conversation. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. Okay, well, step by step is the winner. I think we'll all agree. I'm excited to see where it lands in our top 3 and honorable mentions. Oh, it'll be exciting to see. We'll see. Oh my gosh. All right. We're yes. on to our next song. Yeah. Are you ready? Yes. Okay, here we go. Oh, this one. As long as you got the right stuff, then we go. All right, friends, it's tonight. Andy, do you want to go first on this one? Yeah, I used to hate this song. Like, part of me still hates this song. Like, it's it, it's just one of those, first of all, I hate the video. Like, the video is never going to change my mind because it <laughs> makes no sense. Like, there's literally no, there's I, no like, sense. And, Oh my gosh. And before, before I took this job, I worked at live nation for like four years. So Uh I was actually in their media department. We actually use this song as what not to do when your brain, like it's one of our examples when we're teaching like interns. Fantastic. I I actually had never seen the video until I worked at live nation and I had already, I knew Danny. It's not like I wasn't familiar with like the song. I had never seen the video. I'm like, who put this, crap together i was like it's awful it's and the thing is if you ask some of them they feel the same way so it's not like it's like a unpopular opinion about the video but then you know (laughs) so then i'm working for danny and obviously when you see it live it's a completely different experience because it's the song where they usually go into the crowd and they're taking selfies and they're meeting the fans so it was i i think i had worked for danny like two weeks and he was like I want to go live, you know, we'll, we'll figure it out. He's like, we'll, we'll talk to security and you could just follow. I'm like, you want me to go on the floor with you and follow you while you're doing it? I was like, that doesn't sound like a good idea. Well, it was his good idea. So we made it happen. But I, and I, I, the video is actually on Danny's, like, if you go onto like his IGTV, 
we went live while they were doing the video and that changed my mind, but only for the live version. I can't stand mm. the, like, I will not listen to it on like the greatest hits crap. I won't listen to, I can't do it. But when it's live, it's like, okay, I get it. You know what I mean? Like, it's like a completely different like <clears throat> version of the song. And this, I'm just like, yeah, Joey's got pretty eyes and it's nice to see Jordan covered in water. But you know, other than that, yeah. I don't understand. <laughs> Um, I know the video you're talking about, and um, if it's okay, Andy, I'll, I can share a clip of it. It is pretty cool, it and yeah, it definitely makes me want to want a bar oh, stool. See, yeah, you get to see how emotional people get when they get to take a selfie with him. If they don't get to see him in, you know, a meet and greet, or if they're not That's on sweet. the cruise, or if they have, so it, it's fun to watch the emotion of it just kind of you know so that that video is very special to me because it's it's fun to see it so oh, i love that i know Good. me too <laughs> yeah that's really cool mm. okay. i actually really like the song i like the different melodies blended together the video does suck ass so that does make sense but it does seem like a song that would be sung live you know what i mean it's like fun it's upbeat and you want to kind of go through the crowd like it doesn't seem like something that should be on the radio it's more like a interactive like fun mm -hmm. thing and so it makes sense why the live would, would do well yeah. yeah i despise this song <laughs> i don't think i've listened to it fully for 29 years um i okay so here's the deal about me i don't like repeated syllables in songs i don't like la 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 fa la la i don't like na 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 that's her worst i don't <laughs> like repeated syllables so the whole I'm, I'm trying to like keep this like very outdated masculine image of my five favorite guys and here they are going la 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 like stop. <laughs> so I just don't have not my favorite song. Is the girl 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 it, like I, I don't even know how they do it. The girl 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 I hate that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know what they're trying like That's I know what they're right. going for but I'm like Okay hold on let's can we try it all together on the count of three. Okay, one, two, three. Oh my god, you have to bop your head to do it. Because it just sounds like, yeah, it's it's yeah. not. <laughs> All right, well, love it. Okay. Oh, are we ready for this one? Okay. Again, we have already done a react to this. It might be our most popular video. It is our most. It's our most popular video. Um. <laughs> wonder why. So let's just let's just cruise with it for a moment. Here's our third song, Baby I Believe in You. No, it's not the video. <laughs> okay, we're gonna listen to the rest in a moment, but I just have to interject. Marie Star produced this one. And Marie Star, if you listen to like his early new edition stuff and like Hanging Tough and the NKO TV album, he really likes it when a, a gentleman does the ah, sound. Yes. Am I right? Like in every yeah. album, even in Candy Girl, Ralph goes, ah. Oh, you're right. He does. So it's almost like he enjoys the surprise. He's like, ah, like, I, I don't even know. Like, he's, it's all, like he's all, this is really going to turn him on. Watch. I'm like. Because every girl wants awkward. to be odd in her ear. <laughs> Love it. Okay. It's like, imagine, oh, my gosh. Imagine that in your ear. If someone was like, ah, I mean, wouldn't that creep you out? <laughs> I'd be like, oh, fuck it. Are you okay, honey? I'd be like, are you okay? It wouldn't it's matter if it was crazy. Jordan Knight or not. I'd be like, are you okay? Like, what yeah. a Marie star now. Okay, sorry. <laughs> we'll finish this. <laughs> Baby, I believe in you. And every little thing you do. Okay, we're gonna stop it there. I, I like the song. I like it better when I see the video though. Yeah. That's really all I can do. <laughs> <laughs> we liked the video. We lost our fucking minds when we reacted yeah. to it. So we'll hook it up. You'll see it up there. 
Um, I'll go really quickly. <laughs> I think now that I look back at it, this is my first unconscious, like I don't, it's subliminal. I don't know what the right wording is, but it was my first introduction to porn music. Yeah, that makes sense. And I didn't even know it. Like the beginning is straight up baby making boink music. And then there's a, <sighs> wait, is that a sex sound? It's an exhale. <laughs> Hold on. Is the breathing, is the, uh, it's supposed to be we're banging and this is the sound I make? Yes. Okay. I mean, this is the guy who's saying "oh face" years later. Are we That's really right. Um, no. Andy, what do you think of this this gem? Every time I hear this, I just can't not picture shirtless Jordan. Knight. Yes, like it's it because even if you're listening to it in the car, the first thing that goes through your head is like you immediately pick up on the part where he rips open that shirt. And then you think about like when he does that body roll, because like he does the same like during main event tour, like when he did it again, it, it's like it got worse for me at main event tour. Cause I'm like, oh, he was sexy when, you know, this first thing. And then you watch it again and you're like, oh my God. I mean, you just, this song makes you want to lick him. Yep. Like he literally yep. is like the sexiest. He's, yep. I, I I, I'm not even like, uh, you know, I was always like a hip hop fan and like I was never really like a true like boy band fanatic in a lot of mm -hmm. ways. Like I wanted to like tackle Eminem when I was a, you know, a teenager. <laughs> like That was like my dude. But then it's like he does that and you're like, oh my God. It's like you forget. Ah. It's like during mixtape tour when he was pouring, sh uh, you know, it's like you just stop and you would just have to appreciate Jordan. <laughs> but, and then the awkward part is when you see him backstage. <laughs> you're like, hey. How's it going? Like he just, it's the way, and obviously he's extremely talented singer, extremely talented dancer. And it just kind of, you mix that with like everything that is Jordan. And it's, yep. I mean, it's one of their most iconic, even though it doesn't feature the entire group, you, you still think of it and you're like, yeah, this is. This and, is you awesome. want, and you want to lick. And you want to lick. Yeah, you want to lick. lick him. How many licks does it take? <laughs> um, so real quick, uh, we'll move on to our next song in just a second, but. So Andy, one thing that we really pay a lot of attention to on this channel are the sexy dance moves. So um, I want to share with you our list of sexy dance moves with you, and I want to hear what your favorite one is. Mm -hmm. Okay? So the first is the body roll. The body roll. We got that. Then there's the body rub with the rub down. Then there's the BR squared, which is the body rub into a body roll. And oh you can see that in the Valentine Girl live performance video because mm -hmm. both Danny and Donnie are doing it next to each other and it's fucking hot. Um, then there's the thrust. Mm -hmm. Okay, there's the thrust. And then the newest one, should we, we should give it away. I think this is, okay. It's oh. called FTF, which is when they fuck the floor. Fuck the floor. Fuck the floor. FTF. You know what we're talking about? Like Twisted yep. Joe? Okay. Yeah. So do you have a favorite, Andy? You know why FTF is my favorite? Because usually 90% of the time it's subtle. Like you don't think about it until you watch it later. We were just talking about this because I had to do, we were doing some promotional videos for Dan. Uh -huh. And I was going through footage and he does it when he's done break dancing. Every time he stops and he humps the floor like two or three times. And most oh. of the time, unless you were a true Danny girl, you're not going to catch it. I just happened to see it because I watch enough footage of it. But we were like, yeah, it's it's got that sexual undertone. So it's that hump the floor. And like you said, okay. with Joe with Twisted, you just want to be like, oh, okay, yeah. Joe. <laughs> okay. Well, now I know what I'll be researching tonight. Oh, you know, like, pull that one? <laughs> just go watch, go watch break dance videos literally from like Vegas, like the after dark, all the way to mixtape tour. He humps the floor at the at the end of oh, him. Yeah, my face is getting red. You're already okay. Red. Good. <laughs> Um, do you have I a like favorite? You know. <laughs> I, I, I love fuck the floor. You love but fuck I'm the also floor. The BR squared. Yeah, we're, I'm a BR squared. I think the when they're rolling and they're rubbing, I just like just touch yourself, please. Take me to bed or lose me That's forever. That's definitely my number two. That's yeah. my number two. I think yeah. I can't deal with the air hump. I think it's weird. <laughs> Thanks. Cool yeah. no, All right. Yeah, cool Here we go. Call it what you want. Yeah, I 
Okay, so let's get some Donnie in this. Show a little insert. Call it what you want. on the na na na's, even though you hate the na na na's. <laughs> yeah, you know, I had to swallow it a little bit. Swallow it. Okay. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. I don't like You're Renata. still over the fuck the floor. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> um, I'm assuming you don't like it that much because of the syllable. Okay, that's all I'll say. I don't like repeated syllables. I just don't care for the song that much, honestly. <clears throat> It reminds me of like um, those really cheesy 60s songs that you can't get out of your head, but like you don't want to listen to over and uh -huh. over. It's kind of yes. iconic, but it's like a like a B a B side album that you're like, OK, yeah, I've heard it. it it's just it doesn't it doesn't even sound like them. So right. I've never liked it. <laughs> I think we're all great. We all agree we're all on the same page. Um, Rat Tail Crew, we didn't do a drinking game, but if you want to drink to that, drink it, drink it, baby. Okay. Here we go. Let's try it again. Oh my god, I love this song! I wonder why. <laughs> Do we have to play the Jordan's part? We probably can. Now I know. Jordan Falsetto! Okay, I know. Andy, I always cheat because I'm in control and I always play my favorite songs longer. So, yeah. Um, should, like should, should I start with this song? I'll start. Let's Try It Again is one of my favorite songs. It might be in the top 10. I love a Danny Jordan duo. Valentine Girl is in my top five because it's a Danny Jordan duo. I love them both. And then I have a really crazy, stupid story about it. So when we did the podcast, my so-called whatever, we talked about the need for psychologists to analyze some of us blockheads. To so think about the impact of loving new kids and the impact it's had on our love lives. Like, why am I single? It's probably because nobody can match up to so-and-so. Whatever. But this song came when I was in parochial school. So I was getting my Catholic school on. And when Danny says pray for each other, I was just learning about that. And I fell hard for Danny Wood because he was going to pray with me when we got yeah. married and we were going to be anointed by Jesus. And it got real crazy. Anyway, so Sounds I, crazy. I do love this song. I think it's very sweet. I think redemption in love, giving it another try is really important. So... That's my thoughts. Andy, do you have thoughts? This is this is one of my favorite slower new kid songs. Like I've always and and part of it, I mean, I'm partial look. Like I I'm a little bit partial to when Danny gets his solos, but yeah. it you know, it's also it, it, you're right. It's a great like it looking at it musically, it's such a good combination between him and Jordan's falsetto and yeah. just the the lyrics are really it's really well written it's just it's composed correct like everything from like a musical standpoint because i'm i'm a sucker for boy band ballads more than i am yeah. the faster stuff and so mm -hmm. this is one that just kind of like sticks out because like during main event tour you think of like the you know when they're on like the platform thingies and they're doing the and it was just so awesome to see it live like it, it's it's one of my favorites i'm partial to it so <laughs> i love it she no. like gave the rational yeah and point I, of view and i agree I do, I do i do like the song as well yeah for those reasons i mean i'm not staring at a window like you were but you know or thinking about jesus baptizing <laughs> me and danny sweat okay so weird 
kind of ironic we're filming this on like ash wednesday <laughs> i know, I know. <laughs> I mean, my former catholic my former catholic self is screaming inside what yeah. have you become Okay, here we go. Here is the coup de gras. I don't know what that means. I, I think just said we can it. play this for one second. In can we play it for one second? Okay, oh here God. we go. Okay. Oh, where do I go? Happy birthday, Even understand how you ripped it.